The pups are in my bed. And they're definitely not meant to be. But they, they're so meek and so are they. Mum and Dad aren't here. Everyone else is asleep. I've got them to keep me company. It's so annoying because they're not really allowed up here. But I love them so much and I just think they work so well with my room, you know? <coughs> they do make me sneeze. Yeah, uh, that's the only problem. But they're just so lovely. I don't want them to leave. So my plans for the day are like few and far between. I want to get out on my bike at some point, just go out for a little potter around. Uh, I'm not sure about walking these two because I think mum's going to get back early so she can. Uh, but also, to tonight I'm going out with my friends to get absolutely spasticated. Uh, so... I'm really looking forward to that. Because who in their right mind wouldn't be excited? It's a nice day. It's not quite as hot as it has been, which is good. Uh, because it means I can actually survive outside for more than 10 seconds. Uh, but it's still still warm. There's quite a few more clouds than normal. So uh, I feel like our big summer is ending. I got an email back from one of the new places I applied to for my dissertation. Because I, if you saw yesterday's video, you'd see that I got really angry because the place I was going to be doing my dissertation study decided suddenly, no, you're not doing it there. So I'm trying to find new places. Uh, I got an email back from one of them that's quite good and I know the site reasonably well. So I'm hoping if I give them my plans and stuff that they'll be able to accommodate me. Hey, you look just like how I feel. Super duper lazy today. Yeah, you know even wanting to go outside in the sun. Quite sunny at the moment, lots of shouting kids, which is a bit annoying. Maybe that's why you don't want to go outside, is it? You don't want to be near the shouty kids. Me neither, we're exactly the same. In an entire house of five, we have nothing to put in sandwiches. Like, nothing. I have lettuce, I have tomato, but I don't have cheese or ham or anything to go with that. So, instead, I'm having plain old butter on toast. <sighs> Makes me sad just looking at it, you know? It does taste good. Uh, i just really tempted to order a Domino's crap. I like, I made an order and everything, but I've just realised how expensive it actually is. It's just like paying 15 quid for a large pizza and a side when you could go to the co-op and buy a, a, like a pizza that's all right for like two quid. It's just a bit, a bit sad really. So I'm probably gonna go out on my bike and go and get some snacks for the rest of the day until I go out. Uh, that way I have some food when I come back in as well. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna have to leave the pups by themselves. Scritchity scratch. Oh yes, oh yes. I'm sorry pups, I'm sorry we're not doing much. But mum will be home soonish, I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> He's so happy. <laughs> Hello. Can you kiss the camera? Oh, no. Just played freaking um, ball in the garden with the dog. I got tripped up by Pip. I really hurt my knee. Like, really. Like, you can't. It's not really. Like, you can see where I hit it. But it's just the impact really hurt. In, like, deep in. Inside my knee. I hope it's okay. Cause that really hurt. Oh, yeah. Pizza. Pizza. It's only a co op shitty pizza. But bad job. <laughs> In other news, I just collected a parcel, and inside was this beautiful Bosch cooking book, which is fully vegan. It is really thick as well. Like, like look at that. That's a thick-ass book. It's full of vegan recipes, really well-reviewed. Ellie wanted it for a while, so I bought it for her for her birthday. Like, obviously this isn't a spoiler. She already, she already knows that I'm getting it for her. But I'm glad it's arrived. Like, two or three weeks before Ellie's birthday. <laughs> Pays to be prepared. Right, so it's time for me to get ready to go out this evening. I uh, haven't filmed much during the day, but hopefully I can get some vlog footage during the night. So, there are three steps to getting ready for any night out. Step one, <laughs> shit. Step two, shave. Step three, shower. Congratulations, you managed to get well. Well, you, you managed, no, I can't speak. You managed to get ready in time with me. Brilliant. Ah, oh, this is not a kid's show. Right, I have a mattress set up for Sophie, but I need to find sheets, duvet, and a pillow. Hmm, where am I going to find those? Yeah, the, that's 
They match colours. Yeah. It's amazing. I want to take a picture of Sophie's feet, you know, they're so black and dirty underneath. I didn't stand on the bee. You look like a bee. You look like a slightly more interesting bee. <laughs> if you fell over then, that would have been brilliant. There's Megan. As she gets... Oh, no, she's gone. I can't... Fuck's sake. Stupid roads. There's Megan. As she gets closer, she won't get any bigger. Hopefully didn't have to repeat that joke like four times. <laughs> Work it, girl. Oh, damn boat. <laughs> She's not going to survive, is she? She's not. She's not going to survive. Aww. What is... Why is she so... <laughs> Your bum looks great in that. Her ass does look good, doesn't it? Yeah! I'm a lucky man. <laughs> Beautiful. I mean, I'm taking a video, but... Okay! <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Sat on the chair. <laughs> so weird. Right. Where are we going, else? Get, like, 20... 20? Yeah. Where are we going, else? There. There. HKC. The home of freedom and vodka and oh my god, your face looks. You having fun? Yeah, <laughs> Should there be the place is the vodka bar and it's amazing. You have all these kids' sweet favourites like flavoured vodka. <laughs> that one's rhubarb and custard. Do you not like it? Was it a bit bland? I really love it. It's my fave. I got. You can try it if you like. It's really not nice. <laughs> Chicken and a couple. You got a love heart. Three brown breads. Four How's brown it? Pears. So it tastes love hearty. That's what I got. Five Parma Violet. So there's only one person in the cubicle at one time. Anyone breaking this rule will be asked to leave the prim premises. I don't know if I'm being stupid. Is that how you spell premises? Is that how you spell premises? I thought it was prem I says. I don't know. You're so excited. You're so excited. You're 88% shot. You are. You fucking better be. <laughs> how are you feeling? It's, it's great. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, Hand, hands are stamped. <laughs> right, so that's that's 88%. Yeah? Are you sure? Let's have a little sip. Just, just have a try. Have a try. Right? Yeah, how, how, how is it? My lips are really good. Alright, alright. So we gotta do it. You gotta do it, yeah? Cheers. Come on. Cheers. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Cheers. <laughs> Drink your water. <laughs> Drink your water. 88%. Fuck. Yes. I achieved the impossible. What? Oh. Oh, so we? I'll get Sophia Jacob. Oops. Thank you, everyone.
my chicks. So at least I've got company. Uh, Ellie and um, Sophie left early because Sophie wasn't feeling amazing. Uh, she was really tired, so um, I think they got a taxi home about an hour before I left. So I'm now walking home to catch up with them. I'm quite tired, so I'm going to crash the hurt to sleep. I'm actually uh, currently jogging home because I can't be bothered walking for 35 minutes. So I'm going to jog instead. So, yeah, don't judge my life choices. I made it back uh, running in jeans and in uh, pink soles. Not a good idea. I thoroughly. Do not recommend it. Sorry to cut it abruptly, but I'm going to definitely go to sleep now. I'm shattered. So if you have enjoyed today's video, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. That reads every single day in my life. All the adventures that I get up to. All the crazy shit. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next day's video. Until then, stay safe. Have a good one. And uh, don't drink too much alcohol and then run home uh, two miles. See you later. Bye.